Well, look at this vintage Sony radio. I'm sure isn't vintage, just old. So filthy and disgusting, and someone's taken out the cassette mechanism. It's not in there. It's actually been completely fully removed. Why didn't they just get a radio then if they didn't want the cassette? Let's see what it does. Uh, oh, can't have that. Gotta have it on just static only. Yeah, I can get in a service with Sony. It's absolutely disgusting inside as well. Why did they take the cassette mechanism out? Is the handle durable? It's heavy. Why did it fall apart? It's supposed to be portable and tough. It's got the genuine Sony speakers. 3.2 ohm, 2.5 watts. 3.2 ohm? I've never seen a decimal point ohm rating before. Ah, I may as well blow them out. So exciting and fun. An extra zappy. Oh, I don't want to damage the plug. Yeah, it's all good. What, the handle still survived? Oh, it must be the toughest handle ever. Guess I'm mistaken. Better have that Sony quality that doesn't exist. How exciting. Did the big nothing. Trying to short out the isolation transformer. Oh, the plastic molding's got a date code of September 1990. Not the extra old Sony. That was all filthy and disgusting and missing parts and completely irreparable, but those collectors would just want me to fix it up anyway. Thanks for watching Smash Things 1. If you'd like to support the channel, I have a Patreon set up. Link in the description. See you in the next video.